Welcome to Insight Hub, the video series dedicated to the world of data and brought to you by Miracle's Data Practice. Hi, and welcome to Insight Hub video series. I am Pushpalata Pasham, and I am working as a machine learning research associate at Miracle Innovation Labs. Today, I am going to talk about analyzing employee attrition using IBM Watson Studio and Tableau. In today's agenda, we will be discussing about employee attrition and how the predictive model is going to help in handling the employee attrition. Also, we will discuss the technology which we have used for the use case and we will be having an overview on IBM Watson Studio, predictive modeling, application architecture flow followed by live demo. Let's start with employee attrition. The word attrition in simple words means loss. We can define it as whenever there is loss of employees or whenever we have reduction of workforce in an organization due to some reason. It can be referred as employee attrition. This situation leads to a great loss for the company as too much of hard work is kept in background by all the HRs and recruitment team. Replacing the role of employees will be a time-taking process. So, in order to reduce the attrition rate, we can analyze the employee's historical data. Before we move further, let me show a sample employee exit form. This is the form and these are the attributes which we have collected. Whenever an employee is going to leave an organization, the HR will collect the details of the employee and fill out the form by selecting the options like the employee ID, the age of uh, the employee who is about to leave, and they can enter the salary details, full name, gender, the date on which they are leaving, qualification of the employees, whether the person is from the same work location or not, and how many years the employee has worked on the same shift, how much experience he is having with the miracle, what are all the shift timings he, is, he has been working with, and what is the department joining type and what is the reason they are leaving the organization. Once the HR fills the form and clicks on the submit button, this data will be stored in the database and which we will further use for the analysis or predictions purpose. After performing data preparation, data transformation, modeling phases, the model helps the HR or recruitment teams to predict why the employee is leaving the organization and when the employee is going to leave the organization. So that some measures can be taken to stop the attrition. And it is a self-learning model, which means that model totally works on the data, which is uploaded to the database by HR whenever the employee leaves. For this application, we have used the following technologies, IBM Watson Studio. It is an IBM cloud platform for the data scientists and application developers to develop machine learning and deep learning models. And it is integrated with set of tools, which can be used within our applications we will discuss about this IBM Watson Studio in our next slide briefly. Coming to IBM Watson Machine Learning Service, IBM Cloud Service where we can deploy our built models and we can access them using the service credentials, Python. We have used Python language to build a web application to interact with the deployed model and we have used the Python SaaS module to create the UI. Tableau, it is a business intelligence tool used to create dashboard and visualize the data for better understanding the data in an interactive way. Let me explain you how we have used this technology. We have created a model in Watson Studio, deployed it in Watson Machine Learning Service, and used a Python application to take advantage of deployed model, and later integrated the REST API Watson Machine Learning Service into Tableau. Let's have an overview on Watson Studio. As mentioned earlier, it is an IBM Cloud platform used by the data scientist to develop train, manage, and deploy the models in IBM Cloud. This provides data scientists a set of tools and services under one umbrella for application development. Users can create a project and then can choose a platform using which they can develop the applications. The application can be built around our studio, IBM SPSS modeler. Even they can also create notebooks to build up the applications. We can also add services like Apache Spark, Machine Learning Service, Streaming Analytics, Cloud and like that for our application if it is needed. So IBM Watson Studio is a place for developers where they can easily integrate the tools and services to their applications without any local installation. So the classification model which we have built for the employee attrition analysis is built using IBM SPSS modeler and IBM machine learning service of Watson Studios. Let us discuss them. IBM SPSS modeler. It is an IBM tool used to build predictive models using statistical and data mining algorithms without any prior programming knowledge. We can do data analysis, manipulations, transformations very easily with this tool. Also, we can integrate tools like R, Apache Spark, and databases like Cloudin to 
the streams which we are going to develop. It is having a drag and drop functionality to create the predictive models. And coming to IBM Watson Machine Learning Service, a IBM Cloud Service where we can deploy our predictive models and we can access them using a Service REST API with any programming language. Let us discuss the complete architecture flow involved with the application development. HR fills out the employee exit form whenever the employee leaves an organization. And this form data is stored in the database as a historical data, which is used as an input to build the predictive model. For building the model, we have used IBM Cloud Watson Studio, where we have created a project, created a modeler flow, that is the IBM SPSS modeler stream, which is a feature for Watson Studio project, which we can add. We have built a Navy-based classification model on this data set. Once the model building is done, we have deployed the model into IBM Watson Machine Learning Service, which is a Watson service integrated with Watson Studio itself. For every model we develop, we will get an scoring endpoint using which we can hit the model to score the input. To interact with the deployed model in service, we have created a Python Flask application and we have pushed it into IBM Cloud. Once we have successfully pushed the application, we will get a REST API for the service with which we can score the input from any browser. So like this, we have used these technologies to build the application. Let me show you a demo on how we can predict when and why the employees might leave the organization. For the demo purpose, we have created a Tabla dashboard where we have visually analyzed the employee data and also we have integrated the IBM Cloud REST API for our deployed model in Tableau. Let's start the demo. This is a Tableau dashboard where we have imported the data set and analyzed it. In this tab, we have given an overview on the application and we have explained what our application is all about. As we have discussed this earlier, Let's jump into the next step. Here we did analysis of employees' reasons for leaving the organization. And we have considered the features like gender, experience, age, shift timings, and other details. Let me explain you with an example. Here we can see that female employees having five to six years of experience and who are staying away from their home has left the company with health problems as a reason. As per our analysis, we have found that there are four employees who have left the organization with the same conditions. Now, let us have an under example. Here we can see that there are 16 female employees having one to two years of experience and who are staying away from their home are leaving the organization with reason as marriage. Like this, we can do the analysis. Also, we have filters in our dashboard. So, based on our selection of department and shift timings, the analysis varies. Let's have an example. Let's check only 4 to 1 shift and see how the analysis varies. Let's go down. So here we can see that there are four employees within, with age in between 29 to 32 and who have completed MCA. And um, they were recruited as pressures and they have left the organization with salary aspiration as reason for leaving. So, like this we can do analysis considering the features which we want. So, moving further, we also did analysis by department wise considering joining tab type as feature. So, we can see here in ABDO department, there were six employees who have joined as pressures working in four to one shift with three to five lakhs of salary. So, like this, we can easily get details of employees working in other departments also. And let's check out another analysis. Here we can see, here we can get information like there are total 34 employees in development with five to six years of experience. And here, and here we can see that there are 22 employees in development who have completed BTEC and joined as freshers. Like this, we can do analysis on any data set by creating graphs in Tableau. Coming to the predictive analytics tab, we have integrated the IBM Cloud REST API of the Python application here. Whenever the user enters the details of existing employee, they can score the input from predictive model which we have deployed in the IBM Cloud Watson Machine Learning Service. If the user wants to score the employee details as the gender female and let the age be 25 to 28 and the person is still single and she has completed BTEC and the person is away from the home, she is receiving up to 3 to 5 lakhs of salary. She is working on a 2 to 11 shift and she has experience with Merkel for 3 to 4 years and she is working 
for three years in the same ship, and she is from the active department, joined as a fresher. We can get information like that the employee now is going to stay with the company for next three to four years, and we are saying it with 89 percentage of confidence. And if the person leaves, and she is going to leave the company with salary aspiration as a reason, and we are saying this with 53 percentage of confidence. Like this, we can score the input of every employee which we want to predict. So now let's give another example input. Let the gender be female, again female, and age be like 32 plus, married, she has completed MCA, and she is also away from home. She is receiving salary up to 7 lakhs plus, and she is working for 6 to 3 ships. And she has an experience with Merkel for five to six years. And she's working in the same ship for almost five years, working in development, recruited as a fresher. If we click on Submit, we are getting the predicted results as the employee is going to stay with the company for next five to six years. And we are saying this with the confidence of 79%. And if the person leaves, she is going to leave the company with shift timings as a reason. And we are saying this with 44 percentage of confidence. Like this, we can build a predictive model and we can do analysis of employees' historical data using Tableau and IBM Cloud in order to reduce the employee attrition rate. Thank you for watching a video on Inside Hub, the video series brought to you by Miracle's Data Practice. For more videos, please visit miraclesoft.com slash insighthub.